Okay, in this demonstration, I'm going to briefly show you how to add a hyperlink to an object. I'm calling it an object because uh, we created this school map using shapes here in Google Drawing. So as you can see, I am currently clicked on Classroom C139. Notice it is active. I'm going to next come up here to my toolbar and I'm going to select Insert Link. Now I'm going to have to identify the teacher uh, that is in room C139. I happen to know off the top of my head that it is Mr. Gom. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to come up here to my Strayer Middle School staff page. Uh, you can find this link also here on our direction page right here. It'll open up this page here. As you guys can see, it is our staff directory. It has all of our teachers and also support staff that help us run this building. So as you can see over here in sixth grade, uh, Mr. Gom just happens to be our first one listed. And I'm going to click on Mr. Gom's page, and you'll see that it brings me to his website page. You could even confirm right here that it is his classroom for C139. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to come up here to my address bar, and I click on the hyperlink. And I am going to right-click and copy the URL. Next, I'm going to come back to my Google Map. And all I'm going to need to do is paste the link or the URL right here in my link box. Let's paste it there, and I'm going to click Apply. Now, if I click off of it and I click back on this object, you'll notice that the link is here. Even if I close my, uh, my staff page up there, notice when I click on this hyperlink here, it should open up Mr. Gom's web page. And as you can see, it does. Uh, once you're at this step, you could always click back here on our staff page and work to our next one. Let's say if I wanted to add Mrs. Cronin. Mrs. Cronin, as I scroll down, I can see she's in room B116. So if I come back here, I have to locate room B116, which is right here. And again, I can add a link. I go up here to Mrs. Cronin's page, click on her address. I'm going to click on copy, right click and copy. And I will come here to my link box and I will right click and paste. Apply that link and now Mrs. Cronin is now done. Anybody who clicks on Mrs. Cronin's page, here you go. Quite easy. Yes, it is a little bit tedious, but it will definitely help out our incoming sixth graders. Let's give this a try. If you have any questions or concerns, uh, please let me know. I'll be glad to help out.